A lot of people have a problem, especially in our climate, and as I'm sure you must know uh, that a lot of people have problems with thinking. People don't have thinking skills. A lot of people get bored easily. When you ask them to think, after two, three minutes, they want to just get going. How do you redirect the energies of such persons? In order to think, because we are talking about the mind. If the discipline are, of thinking, how do you acquire it? Yes, if you are going, it's just like the way you acquire muscular, physical effort by training the muscles. When you train the muscles, the first few days is very difficult. There is pain, there is uh, sluggishness, there, is, uh, there are mistakes. The, but after some times, they become proficiency and excellence and perfection. You understand? What is worth doing at all is what doing poorly at the beginning. What is worth doing at all is what doing poorly, poorly at, the at the beginning. You understand? Like they used to say that um, every star was once a disaster. You understand? You have to make mistakes on your way to proficiency and efficiency. So when you look at starting to think, you have to be able to also do the exercise of the mind. And that is where reading comes in. Somebody who is not reading every day can't use the mind. It's, the mind is the thinking apparatus. It's permanently switched off. Permanently. Switched off. It's an apparatus. It's just like the apparel we use at home. A, a, a electrical apparatus. Mm -hmm. Like a television. It's set. a television. It's switched off permanently. To switch it on regularly, you have to train the switch. You have to grease the switch to come on easily. Sometimes to come on permanently. So the mind has to be trained. Trained. And then you have to read books that trains the mind to think. Books about business. If you're going to be thinking about business, you must train the mind about business principles, about business rules, about the laws of governing, governing, uh, governing business. There are several laws. The Pareto law, the business, the, the law of uh, hiring, the laws of de-hiring, the laws of finance, the laws of control, the law of administration. You must know all of this. If you don't know all of this, then you are somehow uh, pressed down. You, there's a bar on you, on your head, to the degree that you know about a particular law. If you are operating the law and it's making you to succeed, you get to a point where you will need another law to go to the next level.